into my hair. Hi guys! I didn't dye my hair. I was just joking, but you probably notice it's just the wig because I don't have that much hair. Like wish, but I don't. Okay, a little story about my own hair. Well, when I was a teenager, I had very long, very dark hair. There were lovely i love them so much they were perfect fortunately the doctor said that i have thyroid problems so unfortunately i started to take tablets i had under active i think under active i think it's under active i don't know it's the one when you gain weight i don't remember now Anyway, I always mixed it up because uh, for a few years actually it was changing from underactive to overactive and from overactive to underactive so I don't know where I'm actually now. But anyway, I started to take my hormones for uh, thyroid. I had three lumps on it as well, fortunately they weren't uh, cancer so uh, I went to the doctors I had the biopsy and all that so it was grand I've changed the medicine and they disappeared unfortunately for the period of time I started to take tablets I lost so much hair like the half of my hair disappeared because like my very own hair like you know when you take the one strand of hair you could tell if it's like thin or thick and my own hair they are very very thick thick but unfortunately I lost like the half of the head and I was like I was devastated you know I was so like I felt it's the end of the world for me and still I have some issues with my hair and because I had like I wore wigs I wore extensions like I even dyed my hair blonde because you um, couldn't see like the like my skin where you have like white hair they were like blending with the color of the skin but then like a few years after like few hairs starting to grow up and of course like i was bleaching my hair so that wasn't helping for growing back so i decided okay i'm not gonna do it anymore so i'm like a brunette right now and br br like brown color the very dark brown color it's my natural color actually my Funny enough, like I love all the colors in the world to have it on my hair and I had like so many of them but funny enough I feel so comfortable to wear like dark brown. Did you ever had this like you know you change you like you hated your own natural color and then you dyed it like and you had it for years and you thought oh my god this is my color but then you, you come to that conclusion that you actually want some change and then you go back to your natural color and you feel so great that is so weird because that actually happens to me so anyway this is the, um, the story of my hair like I wish to have like a crazy funny color so that's why I got this wig I wish to have the full of the hair that is so brilliant I really wanted that because sometimes I just don't feel oh, I just wanted to talk serious and I feel so much confident with my hair because like I have like a feeling that you know all my body is like big and solid and then my hair like my head is like tiny and I have like a tiny little hair but I'm trying to accept that you know there's nothing I can do really with this and um, sometimes I wear uh, extensions but I have to wear very light extensions otherwise you know you're taking you're pulling off my own hair and I don't like that so um, I wear extensions very early 
what is all about this uh, video today as you can see in the title is another haul and this time is from rose girl and i love rose girl it's so beautiful like i love the uh, stocking out there you can find so much stuff it's so unique and i love it this video is going to be all about pink colors and let's talk about this wig first so i got this wig so as i can come to um, like closer to the camera right now you I guess you wouldn't really tell it's not real hair like I've done a couple of pictures and I posted even on Instagram on the storyline and everyone messaged me oh my god you dyed your hair oh you did it I love it you know I love the new color it's so funny but I, I, I got like a few messages oh I had either you in the dark hair and I was like oh my god thank god <laughs> do you know and so like people thought that's the real hair and when you actually touch it it has that feeling it doesn't seems to be uh, like fake they are really good quality like everything is so perfect i feel really nice in, in that wig it's not i hide my own hair very well and it's not sticking anywhere so there's no empty spaces on the top so it's very good like it's brilliant but the only thing that i hate about that wig is the top it's so fake like i don't know if you actually would be able to see that in the camera like perfectly or not but in reality it looks horrible like it's so strong this thing is so fake and like well, you, you don't have this in, the, in reality, so, you know, I'm so sad because I really wanted this wig. So the only solution I have is like to wear a hat or something. For example, I have this pink one. Oh. I have to enlarge a little bit. Oh, yeah. No. But that looks more natural now because it's a thick wig i don't think i like it to have it that long so i'm really tempted to cut the wig and i'll tell you for what length and i, I was thinking to have it for that length so i could easily wear it or even a bit shorter like a bob wig you know because I, I thought that it's gonna be a little bit shorter so have like this what you think I'm gonna ask this question on my blog as well so let me know what you think should I cut it or leave it leave me a comment please and if you say yes well then I'm definitely gonna cut it on the front of camera. So the next thing that I got from Rose Girl, awesome t-shirt with the words, me, sarcastic, never. <laughs> There's nothing I could say really. Good quality, it has some stretch in it. Uh, it's the material that uh, I really like so it's probably cotton blend with some maybe polyester or spandex so that's that's grand um, it's nice to wear um, so yeah highly recommend it next thing is the hoodie I actually saw that hoodie like I don't want to lie but maybe like three or four years ago I saw it on eBay and I always want it because it looks so brilliant and it looks just slightly different as it on the picture I mean it fit me so you can see on the blog how it looks on me 
but to be honest with you i was kind of hoping to have the hoodie fit into me rather than having oversized just simply because i don't really like very long uh, hoodies or sweatshirts i only wear those uh, in the house so i'm happy with that one uh, it's it's not too thin it's not too thick it's definitely worth the money and it has like the cute big button face it's just super super cute you can see the, the fashion look i'm presenting it's comfortable and i like that the next thing i want to show you from rose girl is this cute bag when I saw this bag on the website, I was like, oh my god, this Moby Dick, it has to be mine. <laughs> Look, it's a real Moby Dick. Like, have you saw that movie? I personally love Moby Dick. It's brilliant. Oh my god, she's so cute. Like, I wasn't expecting that good. Like, it's so super cute. And I got this bag for um, holding my camera actually uh, because I didn't have like any small bags. I have like the, the actual proper bag for camera, but it's not stylish. I wanted to have uh, something really cute so I'm a bit dick will hold the camera for me. So yeah it's so cool hey guys so this was my fashion haul shopping haul from rose girl shop and um, if you have any questions just leave me a comment here or in my blog link to my blog is in the description section and don't forget to tell me should i cut the wig or not remember if you would say yes I will film it if you say no well there's there will be no film <laughs> okay guys so thank you very much for watching i had so much fun for doing this haul again and i wish you to have a lovely day and joy and peace and, and love so lots of kisses and hugs bye